you know, it's a lot of matches and the, the, the fall season, it's just about matches and developing this team. And, um, you know, just like a lot of fall events, there was mostly good, couple hiccups, nothing bad. You know, it's just, uh, look, I mean, we, this fall, it's, it's just about, we have a fairly young team. We got three newcomers and you got to get them acclimated and get them acclimated with their teammates and, um, you know, I think everybody's doing a good job in that regard. You know, we were very slow starting in doubles this morning against Chattanooga, which I wasn't overly thrilled about. But, you know, we, we responded the rest of the day and, and had a good day. Well, now, obviously, moving on from there, you need to build as you move forward. ITA Regionals coming up. Uh, just talk a little bit about what you expect from your team taking away from this moving forward. What's well, our last fall event? And... You know, it's just really that regional turns about taking advantage of the opportunities in front of us. You know, we're going to have girls in the main draw, the championship draw, where, you know, we're going to come up against some really good programs, some top 25 programs that, you know, we can't, you know, freeze when we play teams like that because we're going to run into them. We've competed against those teams in the past and have done, we've competed well. You know, it's just maybe breaking through against one of those programs because, you know, that puts your program on the national map a little bit more. And, you know, you beat a team like that, it's, it's undoubtedly going to give anybody that gets the job done in, in that situation a lot of confidence. So, you know, this team, as we head into January, we just got to keep, you know, building this team. We're, we're confident that when January rolls around, we're ready to go for our first uh, dual match. And, um, you know, we're just going to be a team that's just going to be tough to beat once we get into January, and this is what the fall's all about. And finally, we'll ask individually and doubles-wise, who kind of stood out for you this weekend, uh, what you've seen from them so far in their development from the beginning of the year to now? Yeah, I mean, I think just, you know, Emma Michelli, Maria Santilli, just very consistent performers. You know, Emma's been doing it since she got here. Maria Santilli's had a good fall based on what she did last year. You know, I, I thought Anna Felt did a really good job yesterday, winning two singles matches. Um, you know, I, I think our freshmen are doing a good job. You know, I think everybody, everyone's doing their job. Everyone's playing their part. You know, Caroline Morton's coming off a you know, a knee injury, and she's just kind of getting back into the swing of things. Joanna Gunn is playing the top spot. That's never easy. She had a good win today. Look, everybody, they're, they're doing their job. You know, doubles, we need to pick it up because I think the personnel that we have for doubles, you know, we, we can put three good doubles teams out on the court, and I don't think we're really playing to our potential. Right now, it is early, you know, but that's just something, you know, Kat and I just got to keep working with with these girls and, you know, we, we think it can uh, pay off once we get into the regular season. But, you know, overall, the, these girls, it's a fun group. You know, they're, they're doing a really good job. They enjoy each other. They put up with Cat and I at practice. They, they do what we ask them to do. You know, it's it's been a really fun fall so far. And, you know, look, as coaches, you just want to see these girls get the most out of themselves. And, you know, just be great to see one or two of them or even more just kind of break through down at Middle Tennessee State. and. Um, you know, make a good run at regional because it's possible. You know, you, you see teams every year that, you know, they're not, you know, teams you would suspect maybe that would belong, you know, at playing on the final four, final eight of the singles or doubles draws. And we got girls on this team that can do it, but you got to be opportunistic and you got to take advantage of the opportunities that are presented to you. And that, that's what we got to take advantage of, you know, when we get down there next week. So, you know, I'm looking forward to see how these girls respond and compete down there.